incredibly powerful noses and enjoy sniffing to gather information about the world around them. But as they encounter opportunities to sniff and use their nose on a walk, they can receive reinforcement for pulling on the leash. Even if it is unintentional on the part of the person, it makes the dog more likely to pull again to meet their goal of sniffing. While it is important to allow your dog to have fun and do what they love, you also need to maintain control over access to powerful reinforcers, and in fact, you can even use them to your advantage. By training a default check-in behavior, you're offering a choice to the dog to engage with you over the environment, and then reinforcing that appropriately. It teaches the dog that while it's fun to explore using my nose, it also pays off to check in with my person. You can teach your dog to sniff on cue, which can be useful because now the environment is a source of reinforcement that you can control rather than a distraction or something that you have to work against. You can instead use it to your benefit in a way that helps move the training forward. Thank <laughs> you.